made this announcement that's very important. I've been getting up in age a little bit, so I'm uh, thinking that uh, this is our 21st Elvis Fest. 21 years I've done this, 21 years. And I'm thinking that this is a bit long enough for me, and I'm announcing my retirement. today, ladies and gentlemen, and you're about to hear another one, and we're going to do it a little bit of a country style, and I'd like to thank all my friends from Asbury Falls. And, uh, and to make this appropriate, since it's an Elvis set, we're going to do one of the six mother songs in there too, some of your favorite big hits, especially you people in Knox. I know you want to hear a batch. Yeah. So uh, I'm going to have the band set it up with, with an introduction, and I'm going to be off stage so I can make a
especially if it's the Monster Mash. <laughs> you want to hear Elvis do the Monster Mash? Yeah! I shouldn't have asked. <laughs>
before we go into this song, and this is a song that's going to be sung by Rick Dunham, but this particular song, and let me just talk a little bit about my outfit. Uh, what I'm wearing is a little tighter than it was last, two years ago. That's only because I have some kind of medical condition that I tend to put on weight because of potato chips, Oreo cookies, and Hershey candy bar. given to me as a gift and I was very clear. I said I want to make sure there's an eagle on the back or a phoenix. Somehow they got a chicken on there. <laughs>
monster song. Monstrous. <laughs> submit a surfer song that we play at Knott's Berry Farm. I think it goes over really well with the cowboy thing that we do, and I think these two guitar players sound beautiful on it. Let's do Apache. <laughs>
and we're going to do a, a ballad, but we're going to play it up tempo. We're going to play it in the style of bluegrass. Uh, so it would actually be called Love Me Tender. Right here yeah. is the name. Are we having a good time so far, everybody?
that I show these teeth to people. And I normally do the teeth on a fiddle song. But uh, I want to work the cheap seats in the back of the room a little bit. Imagine you're a young lady, it's your wedding day. Everybody showed up to your wedding. Everybody you invited showed up. It was a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful ceremony. And then you notice somebody showed up that you did not invite. Somebody that you did not want to show up. And that would be your ex-boyfriend. Not only did he show up uninvited, but he showed up.
In my brother's car, the whole thing with the teeth, the whole setup. This is a setup for the stupid teeth. I didn't need to even do that. <laughs> <laughs> great. So after I got the teeth, it sounded like this. Huh? Jill Lloyd here and 